What is an orca card anyway? No, it has nothing to do with killer whales. It's actually the easiest and fastest way to pay the fare on all kinds of public transit. Whether you're riding the streetcar, bus, link light rail, sounder train, water taxi, state ferries, or even the fast ferry, an orca card works with all of these different agencies. Think of it like a debit card. You load your account with money and use the card to beep yourself through when you catch a ride. It can actually save you money too because if you use the card a second time within two hours, the second ride is free. If you're a frequent rider, you get discounts on fares too. Mayor Jenny Durkin is actually giving them away for free to high school students in Seattle public schools to help them get around. So how do you get an Orca card? The easiest way to do it is sign up online at orcacard.com or in person at one of those ticket vending machines. It's $5 for your first card, free if you're 65 or older. Something to think about if you're taking the bus or the train, they will be definitely be crowded, more crowded than usual, so avoiding peak travel times might be a good idea for you. So we'll keep tackling this issue all week and through the closure, you can count on us to get to all the information you need. Go to king5.com slash tunnel effect. It's a guideline, guidebook for you, Facebook as well. We've got our group up and running, a lot of questions getting answered. Just search Seattle Tunnel Traffic on Facebook and join the group.